Hey guys, so I managed to pick up the Galaxy Note 8 and I want to do an unboxing and first look at the phone here. Uh, it's taken quite a while to get released here so uh, we have finally got it uh, here and I am very excited to check out what uh, this phone is all about. Probably the most expensive phone I've ever actually bought so far uh, but I think it does come with some nice specifications overall uh, so we're just going to quickly unbox it and have a look at the phone here uh, it's nice uh, strategic cuts so it's not to damage the box strange how we get such a small box over here uh, compared to some others who get massive boxes uh, but maybe you know, Sammy doesn't care about us as much but uh, we're just going to can we unwrap I left a scratch on the box which isn't good uh, you can see we have a nice outline of a pen here which looks nice and we have your sticker Oh, so this is the device as you can see. Just take this out. Wow, this is uh, certainly a big phone. Look at that. Wow, wow, wow. So you can see we have got it in a nice gold color here. Uh, we're just going to put this to the side so we can see what else you get. Uh, so your instructions and stuff, fast charger, adaptive fast charging, your adapters, can't do much without them. Oh, these look nice. You can see, AKG, so very uh, decent pair of earphones here, EO uh, IG955. Your earbuds, a charging cable, and this thing, uh, which looks like a crocodile to me for some reason. Uh, so we're just going to put all this to the side and have a look at the main boy here. Uh, so let's get it unwrapped. Oh, that is a nice gold trinket. Gotta say, look at that. Wow. So you're gonna need uh, a duster, I think, for this one. Keep it looking nice. Very beautiful handset, gotta say. Uh, it doesn't feel that much bigger than the S8 Plus, actually. It feels about the same kind of size here. Uh, but I wish they would have moved the fingerprint sensor like in the middle or something because I think it would be quite a stretch to get to it. Well, it does have an iris sensor, I guess, so it's not a huge deal. Uh, so, very nice feeling handset, not too heavy, you know, quite a good weight about it. And we do have uh, the pen down here, as you can see, which is also quite gold nice uh, color here oh oh my god samsung is so ahead you know i gotta say samsung is ahead when it comes to the build quality how's everyone else going to compete that is the question uh, we're going to boot it up here Let's see would be nice if they had front facing speakers you know they are uh, I think better overall when it comes to multimedia content and we're in so let's uh, go through this nice and quick So 
So yeah, you will need some thumb stretching, I think, for this size of phone. And you got all your iris scanner, as you can see. And your Samsung account, if you want to use your Samsung Health. And some more useful stuff. Wow. So you can see the interface is very s similar to uh, you know your um, S8 here. Shall we connect it to the network? Let's do that. So I just quickly put the password in. Oh. So yeah, you can see swipe up here minimal bloatware which is good uh, just a little bit of samsung stuff obviously as well as the pen kind of stuff as well and that uh, is nice let's get the pen out here oh so you can see we have create a note uh, view notes screen write and some, I think that's the Bigsby thing. You also have your Bigsby over there. Uh, so we can just write on the screen here. Oh, it spins like a carousel here, nice. That is a nice touch. Let's just uh, go onto this one. Oh, you can actually uh, hear it this time. That's nice. Uh, so, how do you save it? Ah, uh, yes, down here. So, I'm guessing the uh, clicky button is there as well. So, you can quickly access things. And it works like where you are, I think. Wow. So this is uh, certainly an interesting uh, you know, value add here, which you're not going to get with the iPhone 10, and something certainly to consider. Uh, also, uh, if you pre-ordered it, you are going to be getting the uh, DeX thing as well, which I will be claiming, which is nice uh, value add. And let's have a look at the camera before we round things off. Uh, so this is the first dual camera, I think, from uh, Samsung. I don't think uh, they've ever done it before. Uh, so I'm just going to see how it works here. So uh, what is it? This one. Full view. So they've really ch changed the camera app here. Probably going to take me a while to get used to it. So we want Ultra HD, these are the camera settings, uh, you can see we have uh, front facing camera as well, which does quad, uh, yeah, quad HD, so 2K selfie and all that, uh, so that is quite nice. So maybe I need to go to, yeah, there we go, uh, Pro, is this it? matrix uh, so you can see you can really get the most out of this camera app here and one thing I've always loved about note phones is the camera I mean the camera has been fantastic on every single note phone it's been beast without uh, much effort you can see the focusing is really fast that is nice uh, so I'm still not noticing though how you actually use the uh, is it this one yeah it could be this one actually yeah I think this is it so this is like the your bucket mode kind of thing 
Uh, it's a little bit hard to demonstrate on the table, but I'll probably go out with the device and do some proper shooting with it. Uh, but you can see this is how it works basically. It's not a new thing, but it's nice that Samsung's finally added that. Uh, so yeah, you know, uh, just a quick little unboxing and uh, first look of the uh, Note 8. Very nice handset indeed. And you know, uh, you're getting quite a lot of stuff here, I think, for your money. It is a pricey one, but you know, I guess uh, there's a lot of uh, work put into it here. Uh, so yeah, just a quick video, hope you found it helpful and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.